A North Palm Beach woman whose good grades growing up earned her tickets to see her beloved Cleveland Indians play is being rewarded like few fans ever are this week. Only on 5, Andrew Laughlin with the story that is 53 years in the making. <laughs> Baseball has always been a passion for Jennifer Wells. The pitcher's man is 10 feet higher than um, the batter's backs. Yeah. And it used to be 15 feet higher. She grew up in Cleveland. I was the biggest Indians fan. In 1966, she was riding her bike to an Indians White Sox game. She earned the tickets like she had before after acing her report card and writing to the local paper. She never made it. I don't remember anything about the day. She was hit by a train, her body broken, her spirit strong. Last year, she showed up with her original tickets from 66. Old tickets? <laughs> And I said, yeah. <laughs> and he said, go to the box office. The Indians honored them. There's so many Cleveland Indian fans there. <laughs> the story gets even better. I joined um, Fit Body Boot Camp just so that I could get ready for this day. Here she is, catching a game with her husband like she does every week at Roger Dean Stadium in Jupiter. He says, yes, dear. <laughs> I say that a lot. On Wednesday, she'll be back in Cleveland for Indians Red Sox, this time on the pitcher's mound. Normally he takes little tickets and, you know, sees a baseball game and throws out the pitch. She read her first pitch on more than 30 family and friends. She reminds us what an old friend recently told her. That's the best use of old tickets he's ever seen. And I thought, boy, that's right. And Jupiter, Andrew Lafome, WPTV, News Channel 5. Mm, great memories and big league spirit. Exactly. So nice of them to honor the tickets. And then, of course, you know, the cherry on top. Hey, throw out the first pitch while you're there. Good for it. her. Love it. Love it. Nice story.